From the concerts to the ice rink, Canal Side in Buffalo has certainly been something Western New Yorkers can celebrate. And now a new addition that once stood in North Tonawanda during the 1920s has made its debut downtown. The historic carousel is fully restored now. It is good to go. And as Tonya Sides Danielle Church reports, it had quite a ride getting here. Plenty of families have prized possessions, but they typically don't include a carousel unless you're in the DeAngelis family. My family worked it, I rode on it. <laughs> I drove it for seven days a week when I was 10 years old. Joe DeAngelis and Annie DeCoste's father, Dominic DeAngelis, left Italy as a teenager to come to the States. All he wanted was to own a carousel. That was his dream. He finally had it come true in 1924, buying this carousel from the Spillman Engineering Corporation in North Tonawanda. It moved to various locations across Massachusetts for people to enjoy. Eventually, the Great Depression hit and Dominic couldn't afford the $69 to keep the land the carousel was on. You'll never believe where he moved it. It was stored underneath the house. All underneath the porch, we put them, put them up on skin. It was later stored in Ohio, but decades later, it's finally home at Canal Side. This is where it's supposed so. to be. The Buffalo Heritage Carousel acquired the ride from the DeAngelis family in 2016. They had artists completely restore it, installed a 153 Wurlitzer band organ, and by the way, the whole thing is solar powered. As Buffalonians enjoy a piece of its past for only a dollar a ride, the DeAngelis family has a simple request. We're very proud of Buffalo, and I hope and pray they have many, many more happy children, happy families coming on, come to this. Take care of their prized possession and love it just the same. Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.